sexting is the act of sending explicitly sexual messages. Though the term is only a decade old, the act is really nothing new. When a macaque female monkey is fertile, and thus can get pregnant, her butt becomes larger and redder, which is of course irresistibly hot for a male macaque. Victorian women were rather inspired by these monkeys, as is Kim Kardashian, and many other women on social media. Unlike our monkey cousins, women's bodies engage in continuous sexting, with permanently swollen breasts. They contain way too much fatty tissue, or silicones, that is functional for feeding babies. Despite the physical constraints of carrying around, say, 500 grams or even a kilogram, the ability to attract and excite men made it an evolutionary advantage to have fully swollen fun bags. Faux nipples, push-up bras, double or butt lifter, they all communicate the same thing. Men, and women for that matter, get aroused upon seeing full swollen labia. Now you do the math why red, brown, purple, pink are popular lipstick colors and why the search Fuller Lips has got over a million hits on Google. The autonomic nervous system has two branches. The parasympathetic nervous system is responsible for the body's rest and digest function. It explains why we feel tired after a big meal. The sympathetic nervous system controls the body's responses when there's a threat, putting our body in a fight or flight response. Blood flow rushes to the legs to enable you to run away quickly, or you freeze and your legs shiver from fear. The parasympathetic nervous system is active during sexual arousal. The body relaxes, pupils constrict, and the blood goes to the internal organs and skin, causing the well-known sex flush. The band Frankie Goes to Hollywood well understood the physiology of the orgasm, explained in their hit song, Relax when you want to come. It's only when giving in to the rest and digest state is when the sympathetic nervous system comes to play. Or should I just say, come. During orgasm, the woman's heart rate raises, sweat glands are activated, pupils dilate, blood goes to the muscles, and most visibly, she shows muscular spasm contractions. In men, the sympathetic fight or flight nervous system causes the erection to go away, which is logical because should you need to fight, having a boner isn't favorable. But in women the effect is less quick. The sexual flush can still show for a few hours, or longer, if we fake it with a little help of a blusher. And when putting on eyeliner, we make our eyes look bigger, as if we've just had an orgasmic experience. Next week, do women have a penis or do men have a clitoris?